A group of three students is chosen from a 34-member class to represent the class on the student council. How many ways can this be done? We first need to decide whether we have a permutation or a combination. Where a permutation is an arrangement when order matters, a permutation is an ordered list with no repetition. And a combination is an arrangement when order does not matter, and combination is for grouping with no repetition. And because we are selecting groups of three students, order does not matter. If we change the order of the students, it does not change the group, which means we have a combination. And the number of combinations of n things taken r at a time can be expressed using any of these three notations here, which is equal to n factorial divided by the product of the quantity n minus r factorial and r factorial. So because we are selecting groups of three students from a 34-member class, we can form a total of 34 choose three groups. We can express 34 choose three using this notation, this notation, or this notation. In each case, n is equal to 34 and r is equal to three. So now let's evaluate this by hand and then we'll check it on the calculator. So the numerator is n factorial, which is 34 factorial. And the denominator is the product of n minus r factorial and r factorial, where n minus r factorial is the quantity 34 minus three factorial and r factorial is three factorial. Simplifying, we have 34 factorial divided by the product of 31 factorial and three factorial. Now to begin simplifying, let's begin expanding 34 factorial, but notice we do have 31 factorial in the denominator. So let's write 34 factorial as 34 times 33 times 32. The remaining factors are 31 factorial, and since we have a 31 factorial in the denominator, let's write times 31 factorial divided by the product of 31 factorial and three factorial. Notice now we have 31 factorial divided by itself, which simplifies to one. So now let's expand three factorial, which is equal to three times two times one. So we have 34 times 33 times 32 divided by three times two times one. We'll notice two and 32 share a common factor of two. There's one, two, and two, and 16 twos in 32. And three and 33 share a common factor of three. There's one, three, and three, and 11 threes in 33. Notice how now we have a denominator of one, and therefore we're just left with 34 times 11 times 16. Let's evaluate this on the calculator. We have 34 times 11 times 16, which is 5,984. Let's also evaluate the original combination. To do this, we first enter n, which is 34, and then we select math, right arrow to probability, which is this column here, and the combination is option three. So we can either arrow down to number three and press enter, or just press three, and then we enter r, which is three, and enter, and of course we get the same result, 5,984. So now we know there are 5,984 ways to select groups of three from a 34 member class. I hope you found this helpful.